I'm Donna Ruco and you're on the list. Let's see, uh, yes, it's still cold. Shaq Shackleford has the stories warming your hands and your hearts around Tulsa. At number one, think warm thoughts. That's what we've resorted to during the freezing temperatures. So we headed to Topeka Roastery for coffee tasting or cupping from the real experts. Their seed to cup mantra means they monitor everything, starting with the coffee trees on their land in El Salvador. Aspirate this liquid into a mist so it hits my whole palate at once. I'm gonna chew that around and then spit it out here in my spittoon. Swallowed. I always say if you don't choke at least once during a cupping session, you're not slurping hard That's enough. It. Topeka offers cuppings on the first Friday of each month. At number two, Go Red for Women. National Wear Red Day is this Friday to raise awareness for women's heart health. Oklahoma State senior Bonnie Neighbors is one of eight apparel design students who created red dresses that incorporated heart health and the emotions surrounding the heart disease. Usually, you know, you're kind of in denial about your bad habits. I put this black cut lace with sequins to kind of shine through. And it's like, you can't hide this and you need to accept it. The dresses will be on display in Oklahoma City in the Paseo Art District Friday. At number three, Bucks for Balls. That's the name of the Humane Society of Tulsa's next spay and neuter clinic. So not only is the surgery free, we will give them $5. A payment for privates, tender for testes, Okay, stopping. We want to make spaying and neutering affordable and accessible for everyone. Bucks for Balls is next Tuesday. Go to thelistshow.tv for more information. Now you're caught up and clued in around Tulsa. I'm Shaq Shackelford.